Globes gives a good sense of the shape and size of countries, but also limit your view to less than half the world at any one time. If we unwrap a globe and lay it flat, the result is a projection that preserves neither the shape nor relative size of countries. We can improve this by stretching the projection, giving true land sizes, but still distorting shapes. Mercator distorts everything and is unfortunately the projection used for Google Maps. Mulvede is a vast improvement over Mercator for most users. Like Lambert, it shows the true size of countries and continents at the cost of distorting shapes. But this distortion is minimized by projecting onto an oval rather than a rectangle. Werner's projection is not in much use anymore, but can be found in certain historical documents from the 1500s. Also, you never know when you'll need a good heart-shaped map. Keep Werner in mind when wooing a cartographer. Collignon might look strange, but still manages to preserve relative sizes. Eckert projections are some of my favorites. Each of Eckert's six projections have different trade-offs between the accuracy of shapes and sizes, and I find all of them to be visually pleasing. Some people, not to be confused with flat earthers, knows that the world is round and therefore a round projection is needed. Other projections may appear of little practical use, but they often have interesting mathematical properties that can be important, especially when comparing smaller map segments. This animation was created with Haskell and Blender. The full source code is available on GitHub.